hey, you're probably using too much soap in your laundry. Stick around, I'll tell you how to fix that. Appliance Factory and Mattress Kingdom, the nation's largest discount appliance dealer. Visit our website for deals and store locations near you. Hey everybody, Ben from Appliance Factory and Mattress Kingdom here to talk to you today a little bit about front load washers uh, that have automatic soap dispensers. So if you're anything like me, I use way too much soap when I do my laundry. You know, I fill the cap on the soap bottle every time, even though I know I don't need to. So problems with that, you know, you're actually gonna have issues moving forward because it leaves soap residue in your clothes. It can't wash it all out. You're also gonna get soap residue in your drum. And if you ever wanna have your kids do the laundry, it causes a potential danger because I don't know if you've ever tried to clean up an entire bottle of laundry detergent that got spilled on the floor, but it's a major hassle. So today we're gonna to talk about some options that let you automatically dispense soap. So you can actually save money by not using too much soap and help the lifespan of your cycles, machines, and your clothes. So. First option here is made by Whirlpool. So Whirlpool actually has what they call their load and go feature. So that's all the way down here at the bottom. So you actually pull this out and it's this guy right here where you can actually put up to 33.8 ounces of soap in there and it'll automatically dispense it into your loads until it's gone. So this is a really good entry level option for this feature. Um, it gives you all the options that you're typically gonna look for in a laundry machine, things like uh, different cycles, cold wash, sanitize features, and even a steam function. So really good entry level option. Problem with Whirlpool is just gonna be, they have the lowest capacity on this one uh, at about 33 ounces. So you're gonna have to refill it more often. Also it is down low. So it's a little bit more of a hassle to get this loaded. Let's go take a look at the next uh, entry in their series though. So. But this one, we're actually looking at the next step up in the Whirlpool series from their load and go options. So this one, it's honestly a very similar washing machine, but biggest difference you're gonna see here is this is a load and go XL. And so this actually is gonna hold up to 67.6 ounces of soap. So a lot longer time between reloading, but that's the main difference between these two options. Uh, but this way, yeah, you don't have to load the dispenser nearly as often. So next we're gonna take a look at a really cool option from GE. All right, so now we're gonna look at an option from GE. So this model has actually been really highly reviewed. It has a lot of really cool features. One of the big ones though is the smart dispenser feature. So this one, it's up top, so it's easier to load. It's right here, and as you can see, it holds up to 50 ounces of detergent. So kind of a happy medium between the last two that we looked at, but enough that you can put nearly a whole bottle of soap in there, which is really cool. And then this one, does actually have some really cool features as well. This has an ultra fresh vent system, which is this right here. And if you open this up and notice, it actually has antimicrobial gaskets as well. So it's gonna help a lot with uh, making sure that the gaskets don't get stinky. And then it pushes air through them during the dry cycle to keep them dry, keep them fresh and keep them clean. Uh, also has steam function. So overall, this is a really great model uh, and a really great option if you're looking for an auto dispense feature. So our next option is from LG, which LG's laundry sets have been top rated by Consumer Reports for a while now. So really good laundry sets, but this is the first one they've come out with that actually includes this auto dispense option. And that's right in here. So this one, you'll notice it does have the detergent option, about 33 ounces roughly. So on the smaller side, but that's gonna be because you actually have the auto dispenser for your softener as well. So this one has the option to preload both of those options and that way, um, really takes the hassle out of this, especially if you do have someone else doing the laundry for you, they can just throw the stuff in here. And with the Think app, which is something that's really cool with LG, you can actually start the machine remotely. And it has a really cool feature where it actually runs an electrical charge through the water while it's running um, and determines based on that and the resistance, how thick the fabric in the washing machine is and adjusts the cycle accordingly, which is really cool. Um, also does have this turbo wash built in. So this is actually going to inject water from all the different sides of the tub. And that way, this one does have one of the best uh, quick washes in the business as well because of that. Um, but overall, like I said, very highly reviewed machines and a really great option uh, for something that does have auto dispense in a modern front loader. So next, let's take a look at the dispensers side by side so you can get a better idea of the capacity. So. Here are all the reservoirs separated from the machine so you can get a better idea of the size and the capacity of these. Because honestly, it's actually really hard to find on some of these 
they use loads versus ounces because a lot of these companies don't really want you to be able to compare apples to apples. So I figured I would just show you the sizes so you can get a feel. So starting on this end, these are the Whirlpool reservoirs. So this is their 33 ounce reservoir right here. Uh, this is their 67. So Whirlpool has a pretty good spread on theirs. This is LG, their detergent and softener. So this one, LG, the claim that they make is 18 loads. So it's hard to compare that directly to ounces, but I believe it to be roughly 33 ounces based on my math. Um, and next is the smart dispenser here on the GE. And this one's gonna hold 50 ounces and takes up this entire back portion here of the actual tray here. So hopefully that gives you a better idea by letting you look at the reservoirs for the relative size of these things. And hopefully that gives you a better idea of why automatic soap dispensers are becoming so popular and the differences in the models that carry them right now. So thanks for watching. Uh, leave a comment down below if you have any further questions or ideas for future videos. Make sure to like and subscribe to the channel. And until next time, uh, keep it clean.